Hi, Fat Yogi friends. My name is Tiffany. I'm a fat yoga teacher trying to make yoga more accessible to everybody. Um, so for today, we will be focusing on vinyasa. Yeah. All the amazing vibes. All right, friends, let's go. All right, friends. So as always, when working in a chair, we want to make sure our feet are flat onto the earth and your hands to your knees. And let's just sit up straight and feel really good in our bodies. So take a deep inhale. Open mouth, exhale. Let it go. Maybe close your eyes here. Deep inhale. Open mouth, exhale. Let it all go. Deeply inhale. Open mouth, exhale. Just check in with yourself here, friends. Maybe wiggle fingers and toes. Flex muscles in the legs, the arms. Bring some amazing energy and love to your belly. Maybe even rub your belly. You can bring some amazing energy to your heart. Maybe place your hand on your heart. And then sit up a little bit taller. You can bring your hand to your lap or keep it on your heart or your belly. And begin to seal the lips and breathe in through the nose and out through the nose, finding that ujjayi breath. This is that breath of life that feels so good. Take a moment, friends, with me, and let's find that grounding feeling. So inhale for four, five, or six. And exhale to that same count, four, five, or six. Sipping the air in through the nose and exhaling through the nose. This is your ujjayi breath. Inhale and exhale. On that next inhale, we open up our eyes and take our right ear to the right shoulder. Stretch out the neck. Maybe our left hand comes down to the side. Take a deep breath here, friends. Then on that next inhale, we come back up to center and exhale, left ear to left shoulder, right hand comes down to the opposite side. One more deep breath. And then come back to center. Go ahead and find two neck circles, going slowly all the way around in one direction. And then all the way around in the opposite direction, going slow here, maybe even closing your eyes or just really trying to be mindful about where you're stretching. Coming back to center, go ahead and roll the shoulders up, down, and back. We'll be doing push-ups today. We'll be working on the plank, 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 plank. So <laughs> we'll be working on lots of things, but First the plank, so let's roll the shoulders and then forward. Inhale, we open, we look up, and then exhale, we wrap our arms around ourselves, bring our elbows down, wiggle our shoulders. Inhale, we open, exhale, we wrap our arms again, opposite hand on top this time, wiggle the shoulders, come back to center, inhale, we circle, Hold a beach ball above your head so it's like a giant beach ball. Maybe we find an arch and we look up and then look to the horizon. Right hand down, left hand up and over. Side stretch. Inhale, we come back to center. Exhale, left hand down, right hand up and over. Side stretch. Both hands come up. We look up again. We look to the horizon. Find a twist. Both arms come down. Right hand to the right hip. Left hand to left leg, find a twist, we look over that right shoulder, deeply inhale, lengthen and exhale, we twist. Coming back to center, inhale, reaching up, exhale, twisting to the left, both hands come down, left hand to left hip, right hand to right leg, extend and lengthen on the inhale and exhale, we twist. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, we twist. Back to center, take your feet a little bit wider, we circle the arms. Bring our hands together and exhale, we fold. Let this forward fold feel nice. Maybe press into the sides of the belly with your hand where it meets the thigh. And then next, inhale, we roll up. Head comes up last, we circle the arms. Press the palms together, exhale, we fold all the way down. Inhale, we find our halfway lift. Relax your neck. Exhale, we fold. Inhale, we circle all the way back up. Press our palms together. Exhale, we come back to center. 
Extend your legs, let's do our legless. Inhale and exhale. We've got this, friends. We'll do five on each side. So for three, for three, for two. Engage your core here, lift your chest for two, for one, and one. Go ahead and set it back down. All right, so the next move in a uh, vinyasa would be to lower down. We do that also by bringing our arms out to the sides. Engage your arms, friends. We look up, exhale. We squeeze our arms together, shoulders together. Inhale, we look up, squeeze the arms, the biceps, the triceps. Exhale, we squeeze the shoulders together. We're working our shoulders hard here, friends. On that next exhale, bring your hands back to your, your thighs. Inhale, we circle. Press our palms together, exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, find your half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, we circle. Exhale, come back to center. Bring our hands behind us. And we find a little arch. We look up. Maybe our chin, or we look forward. Our chin doesn't feel good when it looks up, but we find this opening in our chest. So maybe our arms can't reach behind us, so we just reach them out to the sides. We still feel this opening in our chest, just like we would if we were in an upward facing dog. Open up to the sides, we look up, we lift up. And exhale, we release. We find our downward facing dog. So here we can extend our arms and bring our, our, our arms out to in front of us, engage our core, and hinge at the hips, lean forward. This would be how it would feel in your down dog, but you're not putting any weight on yourself. Engage your core, relax your shoulders. Your arms are on, your legs are on. Engage all the muscles here, friends. And then exhale, we come back to center. Let's circle the arms, go through the whole thing. Press our palms together, exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, find our half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, circle the arms, coming back to center, pressing our palms to back to center. Take a deep breath, friends. Amazing job. Thank you so much for practicing with me. Inhale, we circle. Press the palms together. Exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise. Find our half lift. Press our palms onto the chair. Take our feet back. Find your plank. Engage your core. Lower down for chaturanga. Inhale, we come up for upward facing dog. Exhale, we hinge at the hips, and we find our downward facing dog. Maybe take your feet a little wider here, friends. Relax your neck. And take some deep breaths. Should feel good on your hips. On that next exhale, we step our left foot forward, find our half lift. Exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, circle arms. Press the palms together and exhale, we come back to center. All right, let's do this with blocks. One more move. All right, friends. Down, we're facing dog. We got this so much, let's do this. All right, inhale, we circle. Press the palms, exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, find that half lift. Exhale, we plant the hands, set our feet to the back. Find the plank, lower down for chaturanga. Inhale, we scoop up and find our upward facing dog. Exhale, we bend our knees, shift our hips back. Here we are. And then push into the toes, lift the hips. Find this version of downward facing dog. Relax your neck, look to the back of the mat. Take your feet a little lighter, bend your knees, push into the hands, and then straighten the legs. Relax your neck. Shoulders away from ears. Push into the hands. Push into the hands. On that next exhale, we walk our feet to the blocks. Find our halfway lift. Exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, circle arms. Press the palms together. And exhale, come back to center. And that's it, friends. Thanks for flowing with me. Um, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell, check out my Teespring for awesome stuff. I just added affirmation cards to my Teespring, so a million great uses for affirmation cards, which is listed, so go check it out. Thanks. Bye.